capital Paris who are at the Pac de Pass. My name is Derek Ray, and sitting alongside me in the commentary box, providing expert analysis, is Stuart Robson. I'm very much looking forward to bringing you the second leg of this quarter-final tie. It's Paris Saint-Germain up against Eintracht Frankfurt. Well, I thought the first game was excellent. Hard fought, evenly matched, chances at both ends, and a lot of good individual performances. Hopefully, Derek, we get more of the same today. Introducing the Paris Saint-Germain starters. Gianluigi Donnarumma is the keeper. Nordi Mukiele starts alongside Marquinhos in central defence. Lionel Messi starts alongside Marco Verratti in the engine room. And the tactical configuration has two players in attack from the very outset. Well, a top-notch piece of defensive judgment. Hakimi. Promising looking ball. Now moving the ball impressively here. Verratti. Failed to keep hold of it. Jesper Lindström. Buta with it. Not showing good defensive judgment. Hang on to the ball. Soler. Now with Hakimi. Soler. Well, the fans really want him to shoot. Mbappe! Mbappe with it. Danilo Pereira. Verratti on the ball. What has he got up his sleeve? Hakimi. Well, this time. is finely balanced could really do with testing the goalkeeper from one of these fired over by Messi well able to close down the short Messi had a useful cross sound piece of goalkeeping Aurelio Buta out of play and a Frankfurt throw-in forthcoming. 
Well, let's get more details on the injury situation from our pitch side reporter, Jeff Shreves. Oh, that's a real concern, looks from the bench, I have to tell you, because he's landed right on top of his elbow, and that's causing him some serious pain at the moment. Cheers, Jeff. Kimpembe. Verratti now. Hakimi. Superb block on the back of the ball from the flank. Soler. And the goalkeeper covered a lot of ground to push that away from danger. Ndika. Lindstrom. Perfect challenge. And it's Messi going forward. What's he going to do next? Intense pressure. He takes aim. Able to get a body in the way. And all the way through it goes to the goalkeeper. Toro Muani. Gibril So. Horde. Oh, a vital interception. And that is that for the first half here. Into the second half, here at the Parc des Princes. Good use of advantage in favour of PSG. Able to skip past his man. And he might be through here. Great goalkeeping. Well, what a save that is. He was so alert there. And over it comes. Just far too close to the goalkeeper. Hakimi. Verratti now. Can they create something from here? Well, didn't go as a plan in the end. Rode might be able to set up the chance. Splendid defending, and it needed to be. Keeper at fault. Well, we have 30 minutes to go. Rode. So. Good movement. Well, he really read that brilliantly. Will they get themselves level here? Oh dear, oh dear, opportunity squad.
squandered, Stewart. Well, what a chance that was for the equaliser. You don't get too many better than that. And the referee has decided to award the free kick to PSG. Renato Sanchez. Defensive Brazilians to shut them down. Now potential danger. And a goal! And I'll tell you what, that gives them a bit of a cushion now. Well, as you can see, the defending is really poor, but he won't mind. It's a simple finish for him. On aggregate, it's three goals to one. Dina Ebambe. Superb defensive judgment to end the attack. And the conditions look pretty good for the counter attack. Well, it fizzled out. Now, can they create something? The end product just wasn't there. Neymar. Might it be Mbappe? And he's searching. Certainly in the mood for his second. Well, he's certainly looking a threat. He looks so sharp today. And a PSG corner. <laughs> over it comes. And he's done well to tip it over the bar. And that will be a corner. Lindstrom running with the ball confidently a chance to whip it in oh a vital interception ten minutes to go then really getting stuck in can he put it away? Well, not every keeper would have been that brave. Well, he read it brilliantly, didn't he? Top stuff from the keeper. And does well to keep it in play. Chance to play it in. Renato Sanchez. Return to Bernat. Neymar. And he scored not once but twice. They simply cannot stop him. And no wonder he's enjoying himself. Just to confirm the aggregate situation. 4-1 is the score. It's a splendid through ball from Neymar. And that attack going up a dead end. And the keeper has the ball. So two minutes to be added on at the end. And a bad pass it was. Koro Muani. There's the final whistle. The home fans are jubilant. They are going through.